The United States Senate Select Committee on Intelligence sometimes referred to as the Intelligence Committee or SSCI is dedicated to overseeing the United States intelligence community the agencies and bureaus of the federal government of the United States who provide information and analysis for leaders of the executive and legislative branches. The committee was established in 1976 by the 94th Congress. The committee is select in that membership is temporary and rotated among members of the chamber. The committee comprises 15 members. Eight of those seats are reserved for one majority and one minority member of each of the following committees, Appropriations, Armed Services, Foreign Relations, and Judiciary. Of the remaining seven, four are members of the majority, and three are members of the minority. In addition, the majority leader and minority leader are non-voting ex officio members of the committee. Also, the chairman and ranking member of the Committee on Armed Services if not already a member of the Select Committee are ex officio members. As part of its oversight responsibilities, the committee performs an annual review of the intelligence budget submitted by the President and prepares legislation authorizing appropriations for the various civilian and military agencies and departments comprising the intelligence community community. These entities include the Office of the Director of National Intelligence, Central Intelligence Agency, Defense Intelligence Agency, National Security Agency, National Geospatial Intelligence Agency, National Reconnaissance Office, as well as the intelligence-related components of Department of State, Federal Bureau of Investigation, Department of the Treasury, and Department of Energy. The committee makes recommendations to the Senate Armed Services Committee on authorization for the intelligence-related components of the U.S. Army, U.S. Navy, U.S. Air Force, and U.S. Marine Corps. The committee also conducts periodic investigations, audits, and inspections of intelligence activities and programs. Topic history The Select Committee on Intelligence was preceded by the Church Committee 1975. Senator Daniel K. Inouye D. Hawaii became the first chairman of the committee when it was established until 1979. Former Director of Central Intelligence George Tenet was staff director of the committee when David Boren of Oklahoma was its chairman. The committee was the center of much controversy and contention during the run-up to the war in Iraq in 2002 and 2003, when chairmanship of the committee changed hands following the November 2002 election. Among the committee staff members at that time were, Pete Dorn, professional staff member, Jim Hensler, deputy staff director, Vicki Divill, general counsel, Stephen Cash, professional staff member and counsel, and Alfred Cumming, minority staff director. On July 9, 2004, the committee issued the report of the Select Committee on Intelligence on the U.S. Intelligence Community's pre-war intelligence assessments on Iraq, and on June 5, 2008, it issued a long-delayed portion of its Phase II investigative report, which compared the pre-war public statements made by top Bush administration officials to justify the invasion with the intelligence information that was available to them at that time in a March 6, 2008 letter to the Senate leadership 14 of the 15 then members of the committee proposed the creation of a new Senate Appropriations Subcommittee on Intelligence to prepare the annual intelligence budget 
the proposed subcommittee, on which members of the Intelligence Committee would be heavily represented, would increase the committee's influence and leverage over executive branch intelligence agencies, and require continuing disclosure of the annual budget for the National Intelligence Program. The proposal has been opposed by the leadership of the Senate Appropriations Committee, however, in 2013, and beyond, the SSCI received renewed attention in the wake of Edward Snowden's disclosures regarding the NSA surveillance of communications. Senator Dianne Feinstein and the SSCI made several statements on the matter, one of which was notably disputed, that the NSA tracked U.S. citizens' locations via cell phone. Later, the SSCI staff director, David Granis, claimed that the NSA did not collect cell phone location, claiming the senator was speaking extemporaneously. The SSCI later came to prominence in relation to voting to publish in March 2014 and then publishing in December 2014 of a report on the policies of the CIA on torture. Beginning in 2017, the SSCI has been investigating Russian interference in the 2016 United States elections, possible incriminating links between members of the Russian government and Donald Trump's presidential campaign, and the security of election processes in the United States. Members, 116th Congress Source, member list Members, 115th Congress Source, member list Topic Chairs Topic Staff Directors Christopher Joyner, twenty fifteen present David Granis, two thousand and nine to twenty fourteen Andy Johnson, two thousand and four to two thousand and eight Alfred Cumming, two thousand to two thousand and three George Tenet, nineteen eighty nine to nineteen ninety three Topic See also Senate Intelligence Committee Report on CIA Torture James R. Clapper Section Testimony to Congress on NSA Surveillance Programs, 2013 List of current United States Senate Committees United States House Permanent Select Committee on Intelligence United States Senate Committee on Armed Services Computational Propaganda <laughs>